he really don't like being held anymore. Ever since you've been hanging around with Chi Chi, you think you just <laughs> hanging around with Chi Chi, you think you just hanging <laughs> around with Chi Chi, you think you just. <laughs> channel my name is autumn this is the dope season for the guys who are new and who have never been here before thank you guys for tuning in and watching this video so for today's video i have a special treat as you can see i have a little buddy right here you want to say hi i had to put them down because as you can see chi chi had a little bit too much energy so i'm going to try to make this video as short as i possibly can because i don't want to keep you guys up here too long um I have two chinchillas, one is named Chi, um, and then the other one is named Glizzy. Now, I'm going to start, start off with Chi, how I got Chi. I actually adopted Chi and I was able to get him for free. They're jumping on each other and, hey, you know you're not supposed to be on there. He's trying to get this, with his oats. Hold on, y'all. He was sitting up there trying to get his little oatmeal snacks. So now maybe he will actually uh, be a good chinchilla. If I'm sitting up here feeding him oatmeal. You dropping it on the floor, boo-boo. Okay, so this is Chi. How I actually adopted Chi, um, like I was saying, my ex, my ex's dad worked with this lady who actually had Chi Chi at the time. And she had named him Fuzzbud, so he had a completely different name. And she had him since he was like a little, little, little chinchilla. So, um, one day, my ex came home and was like, yeah, um, you remember that lady with the chinchilla? Because I actually met him a year before I adopted him on my birthday, which, you know, it's kind of very convenient. But, um, she, he was like, yeah, the lady with the chinchilla, she's giving it away for free if you want. And I'm over here like, yes. And I jumped at the chance to get this little fella because I fell in love with him, like, the first day. He's so soft. He had so much energy and he was so nice and personable. So I was like, oh yes. So one dark and stormy day, we went over there and I just picked him up. She had him living inside of a plastic box. Like she drilled holes into his box because she could, I guess she didn't want to afford a, a cage because it was too expensive. I jumped on the chance to get a cage as soon as I could. But anyways, um, yeah, so that's basically the short story of how I got Chi Chi. Glizzy, ever since I've actually, um, he's been comfortable and warming up to Chi Chi or whatever, he's just really been, um, off the wall. So, I'm not even gonna hold him because he didn't, he smacked me in the face with his tail. I don't, I'm, I'm a little hurt right now. I'm a little hurt. <laughs> but yeah, so, really, really quick, make a long video short. Um, I got Glizzy at this around about uh, little place, little um, animal shop or whatever because me and my friend was just like, hey, why don't we just go shopping for chinchillas, like window shopping for chinchillas and we can probably see something that we like. We weren't even planning on buying a chinchilla that day, but we walked to the shop and we saw they had two chinchillas. It was this gigantic white chinchilla, which um, if he wasn't so angry looking, I probably would have bought him too. He was only like $300. But, um, then I noticed Glizzy, and I really wanted a white chinchilla, to be honest. I wanted another male chinchilla, but I didn't want an adult chinchilla, and I saw Glizzy. But the thing is, Glizzy was kept in this cage. It was just broken. It didn't look like they changed their bedding in years. The food had poop and stuff in it. It was just horrible. Like, the conditions were just horrible. And I picked Glizzy up, and I immediately made a connection with him, like, he came to my chest and he laid his head down and he was just sitting there winking and for people who know about chinchillas and stuff when chinchillas wink that means that they're happy it means they're content and um, then when he was he even looked up at me he was just like all up my nose and my face and the ladies at the place were like oh the workers and I was just like yeah I need this chinchilla so I put him back and I was just looking at him and I just went around the store just walking around and stuff and he was just looking for us like he was just looking around like what's going on so we left out and um came back and when we came back we noticed that we couldn't see glizzy anymore so i'm over here like where's glizzy and i went around the corner to the back of his house because he had um 
they cut they had uh, clawed out a part in the back of his house I guess because the bigger chinchilla basically was bullying um, Glizzy so when I came back I saw Glizzy I was like oh my gosh Glizzy and the bigger chinchilla came and sat on Glizzy and I'm over here just like what and I just heard them squeaking and next thing you know the bigger chinchilla went into his house and, and Glizzy's just sitting there just shaking like a leaf I was like oh no Oh, we have to get them today so we just paid the whatever it cost it didn't even really matter we just wanted to make sure that he was in there now his temperament at first was not welcome he was scared he, he was jumpy but he's really warming up now like he really he'll come to you but he won't stay for too long I don't know why he does that but I'm giving him probably like about six more months and he'll be just like Chi Chi you know coming chilling sleeping in my lap and everything so yeah make a long video short that is how I ended up getting my beautiful, beautiful chinnies, my chinchilla children or whatever. And yeah, I'll have more videos about um, my chinchillas and everything as the time goes on. Y'all gotta give me some time because y'all know I work a full-time job and sometimes I work over full-time with that job. So just be patient with me, you guys. I got y'all on these videos. Thank you so much for watching you guys again this is a dopest season if you enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a like if you enjoy me or my channel and you just want to support me in a way that you don't have to give me money please just hit that subscribe button it don't cost not a ting not a ting at all i will see you guys in my next video in the meantime peace and love